If you need help, all you have to do is ask. And this, dear player, is the place to do exactly that. Choose this horse and carriage after you have chosen your destination from either your notebook or the directory. It will take you where you want to go. When you believe you have directed Holmes to all of the right and proper places, and you have enough information to name the murderer and the motive, choose this icon. I believe the inspector may have an interesting case for us, Holmes. I told you, Watson, I am tormented by a migraine and I need to take my cure. I'll take only a moment of your time, Mr. Holmes. Go on then, inspector. But make a stab at the essence, please. All right. A Mr. Melvin Tuttle, a junior partner with the law firm of Sloan, Swarthmore and Cartwright, dropped dead of a heart attack yesterday. We believe it was poison. Oh, yes, Sloan... The answer to this conundrum must be somewhere in this room. I shall select the cards to find the logical sequence of what this automaton displays. Fantastic! Superb! There, Maestro. I believe that everything is settled. This collaboration will be my crowning glory, my masterpiece. Merci! It seems that the garden was well maintained.
Inspector Lestrade, when will you remove my husband? Senate says he did not know the man. He was elderly and spoke with a French accent. Senate told him the general never saw anyone in the morning while he was at work. The gentleman insisted that if Armstead read the letter he had with him, he would make an exception. And so it was. Senate took the letter in, Armstead read it, and went quite pale. He told Senate to let the gentleman in. Sensing something amiss, Senate dawdled in the area of the study for... Society burglar strikes again. Mm, series of burglaries. Six over the period from June 2nd to June 17th. On July 2nd, the 7th occurred at the home of Sir Sanford Leeds. Cleopatra Tiara stolen, it says. As in the other cases, uh, no... Francis is totally incapable of murder. Not even of a scoundrel such as Guy Clarendon. Scoundrel? But he's from such blue blood. Also, if I'm not mistaken, he's an accomplished batsman for the West London Cricketeers. What rubbish! What balderdash! You must have read something terribly disturbing, Watson, for you to be so overwrought this early in the morning. Indeed, Holmes. It's irresponsible of the times to play upon people's superstitions. Ah, you must be referring to the affair of the mummy's curse. Poor child. Holmes, you should help him. Brave Toby, the best nose in the British Empire. <laughs>